Our Reflectix sunshade is an absolute must for regulating the temperature in the van. The front windshield of the van is huge and it's pretty amazing how much heat you can gain or lose depending on the season. So we put ours in the window almost every time we park and it makes a massive difference, especially in the summer when we're trying to keep the van cool. We couldn't find one that was the right size for our van, so we just bought a roll of Reflectix and made our own. Next item, this step. I know it doesn't seem like much, but it's been a lifesaver. And let me show you what we use it for. So you can see why we would need a step, right? I'm six foot tall and it still is quite a jump to get on top of this bed. And that definitely is our fault because we actually ended up putting an eight inch mattress on top of this bed. So it's kind of high now. And that's why we had to get a step. So this is like a kind of spongy toweling uh, material. And then on the inside, look, you've got your drying rack. So the plates go in there like that. And then they just sit on the side like that. It's fantastic. It's so cool. And it saves so much space and it saves all the time of having to use tea towels. This stuff is really, really quick drying as well. And I like this because it's extremely stable. This is the little case that it fits into. And then this goes in it just like that. And um, it's virtually impossible to tip over. Um, I will say, that these canisters, if you see them and you have this kind of stove, go ahead and buy a few because they're not available as, let's say, as much as a propane uh, fuel would be. Speaking of bug nets, we did another do-it-yourself project and cut out these mesh bug nets and fit it to the back of our van, also the windows in the front, put them up with these magnets. Now we're still able to enjoy the outdoors but have the protection of the net. Once we forgot to put this thing up in Idaho and the mosquitoes were out of this world, we had 50 mosquitoes in our van and couldn't go to bed until all of them were dead. It's a very bad night in van life.